Hello Cancers, this is your monthly read for August 2022. Take what resonates, leave the rest. Alright Spirit, what do you have for my Cancer babies? For the month of August 2022. Sorry, I didn't mean to hit the camera. There we go. Got the Ten of Cups popping right out of the bag. So you could be focused on family, emotional uh, stuff, uh, family heart stuff. We have the Queen of Pentacles and we also have the Four of Wands. You could be dealing with an earth sign. You don't have to be. Um, I feel like that you could be trying to connect with a certain energy of, come on, let's have a family. Let's get our family together. Let's, let's do family gatherings. Um, we do have the Four of Wands. Somebody could be getting married. This also could be you. Or you could be thinking about this person as marriage. But this could also mean that you are just going to the next level with this person. Like if you're dating somebody, you could go to exclusive. If you're already exclusive, maybe you're going to get engaged. If you're already engaged, maybe you really are planning that wedding. So I feel like that it's a, it's a ascension um, with this person. This queen, and keep in mind that this does not have to be a love reading. I've been having to tell a lot of you that lately. This does, this does not have to be a love reading. I'm just telling you what the cards are saying and how I'm interpreting them. This could be about, uh, it could be about love. It could be about work. It could be about a family member, a friend, whatever, however it resonates for you. But there is a connection here that you see them on a very high emotional level. You love them a lot. You want to build with them. Um, you want them to be your everything, your utopia. And the Queen of Pentacles is somebody who is very loving, very giving, very loyal. They want to take care of you. They, they will give you the shirt off their back. So with the Four of Wands, it's like, I'm never letting you go. <laughs> You're like, I'm never letting you go. So let's just, let's just make it official. I feel like that you're making something official and you're tired of waiting for something to be official. I do uh, feel like that this is going to happen fast once it starts happening, but the eight of wands is very fast incoming communication. Now this could be you giving them communication or this could be them communicating with you, but either way, the result of that is the four of pentacles. It's like, let me hold on to what I need to hold on to and let me think about it i feel like that you're thinking about it i feel like that this could possibly be a past relationship the reason why i say that is because we have the death card this signifies to me that there's a rebirth that has to happen which means this could possibly be a past relationship where this person comes in and they're like hi guess what i'm new and improved i've had a rebirth i'm gonna make this happen you know i'm a changed person and I feel like that you could possibly be going for it. We do have the King of Cups here. I feel like this is your energy accepting it with warmth, with love. And you're like, you know what? You better not fuck up. The King thinks with their mind more than the Queen. Like, I feel like this. there's a person that's coming in that is like the Queen of Pentacles type. Like, they're very good with money. They're very good with everything. But there's something that happened in the connection that you're just kind of skeptical of. You're like, you better not fuck up again. Because if you do, it's a wrap. And that is, that's the king of cups all day long. I'm going to give you your... I'm going to give you my love all day. But you better not mess up. And I feel like this person is coming in to let you know how much they have changed. And this is why you are contemplating having a relationship with them. It's going to be for the month of August. All right, Spirit, what energies is around my Cancer Babies for the month of August? And then we get all of these. We have Taurus. We have Scorpio. We have Sagittarius. We have Capricorn. And the bottom deck energy, we have Libra. So that's what I have for you. I'm curious because it keeps kind of spinning. So let me see. Five of Cups. See, you're going to be a little skeptical. With the Five of Cups, you're like... This better be true. This better be right. Because I'm not trying to go backwards. I'm only trying to move forward. 
So that's what I have for you, Cancers, for the month of August. I'm sending you all kinds of love, light, healing, and protection. Have a great month, and I will talk to you soon.